the Lord be with you and with, with your spirit. Our reading from the Holy Gospel according to John. Glory, Glory to you, O Lord. Chapter 1, verses 45 to 51. Philip found Nathanael and told him, We have found the one about whom Moses wrote in the law, and also the prophets, Jesus, son of Joseph, from Nazareth. But Nathanael said to him, Can anything good come from Nazareth? Philip said to him, Come and see. Jesus saw Nathanael coming toward him and said of him, Here is the true Israelite. There's no duplicity in him. Nathanael said to him, How do you know me? Jesus answered and said to him, Before Philip called you, I saw you under the fig tree. Nathanael answered him, Rabbi, you are the son of God. You are the king of Israel. Jesus answered and said to him, Does, Do you believe because I told you that I saw you under the fig tree? You will see greater things than this. And he said to him, Amen, Amen, I said to you, you will see the sky opened and the angels of God ascending and descending on the Son of Man. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. My dear sisters and brothers, Bartholomew, one of the twelve apostles, is called by Nathaniel by St. John. Scripture scholars tell us that the two, Nathaniel and Bartholomew, are the same apostle. Bartholomew should be the second name of Nathaniel because Bartholomew means Bar Tomai, son of Tolmai. And the first three Gospels do not give the name Nathaniel. They give the name Bartholomew among the twelve apostles. And St. John does not speak of Bartholomew. St. John speaks about Nathaniel. And that's why the scripture scholars say the two are the same person. Nathaniel was a person who started his journey of faith with the prejudice. Philip found Nathaniel and told him, we have seen the Messiah, the one about whom Moses and all the prophets have spoken. He is Jesus, son of Joseph from Nazareth. Then comes the prejudice of Nathanael. Can anything good come out of Nazareth? Then the invitation of Philip, come and see. When Nathanael came to Jesus, Jesus said of him, Here is a true Israelite in whom there's no duplicity. It is very interesting the command of the apostle, the command of St. John. Philip found Nathaniel under the fig tree. And that is very symbolic. Fig tree is the symbol of of the messianic age. And Nathanael was seen under the fig tree. And that means Nathanael was a person who was longing for the messianic age, the age of the Savior. And when Nathanael came to Jesus, and Jesus accepted him as one of the twelve. Nathaniel said, You are truly the Son of God, the King of Israel. Nathaniel accepts Jesus as the Lord and Savior. And his testimony becomes 
a testimony powerful. The Son of God, the King of Israel. My dear brothers and sisters, this invitation is for every one of us. Come and see. We may have our own prejudices. We may have our own thoughts of ignorance. But the one great testimony of the apostles is Jesus is the Son of God, the King of Israel. It is in Jesus that we find our salvation. And that testimony is the greatest of all the testimonies. In Jesus we find our salvation. Let us accept Jesus as the Lord and Savior and turn to him at every moment of our life so that we may experience salvation in Jesus. In the moments of our troubles, in the moments of our hardships, in the moments of our sinfulness, in the moments of our sickness, Jesus is our hope. It is he who saves and he will save us from everything that is wrong in our life. Let us accept Jesus as the Savior and Lord with Bartholomew and be able to profess, able to bear witness to Jesus, to others, so that everyone may come to accept Jesus as the Lord and Savior. Amen.